what's up you guys? I'm gonna show y'all by refrigerator. I think I showed y'all before, but I'm gonna show y'all again. I always used to have food stocked all the time. And you know, like steaks, hebro meat, everything. It's always stocked up, as you can see. And then uh, the other part, I always had something in it, always. Then I'm gonna show y'all. So y'all see, y'all have, you know, stuff all the time, you guys. So y'all see that I pretty much take care of, always take care of, always. So what is everybody up to? Is everybody having a good day? Oh, YouTube, Facebook, TikTok, it's going to go on all platforms. Sorry, I haven't been posting that much. I've just been dealing with other stuff in my life. Uh, I'm back at girl. I'm back on social media posting and, and pretty much everything. So, so if anybody wants to message me, just message me on Messenger. You know my Messenger and everything like that. And I hope everybody is having a blessed, blessed uh, this Tuesday. I think it's Tuesday. Yeah, yeah, Tuesday. So, if my phone doesn't get paid by tomorrow, you know, which is due, and it's like $65, if you don't uh, pay it by the 29th or 30th, they, they uh, pretty much you can't save that $15 off. So, the bill is usually like $55, you know what I'm saying, plus tax, but, but, is due right now on the 30th, you know what I'm saying? So now I got to pay an extra $15. So all together, I got to pay $65 plus tax. So if anybody knows anybody that can really help, even with half of it, I appreciate it. I'm not asking for much. I'm not asking for nothing. I'm just asking for help. So that way my phone could be on and everything. And then I could make sure my phone stay active so that way I could post videos and, you know, if people could get a hold of me and stuff, there are people that need to get a hold of me. I appreciate all y'all guys. I love all y'all guys and hope to hope to hear from y'all soon. I know y'all probably living your best life. Some of y'all some of y'all are living your best life. And stay continue living your best life. Don't ever let nobody tell you anything different. Because everybody try to tell you something. Do people don't know what the heck they talk about. Always remember, stay positive, stay blessed, and stay away from uh, scammers, stay away from liars. If somebody tells you to do something that you ain't supposed to do or you don't want to do, just block them and delete them, report them, and move on. Because I noticed lately it's been a lot of scammers hit me up on my inbox, a lot of them. And you can tell from a scam in from the real and the fake. You know what I'm saying? Because whenever you start talking to somebody and somebody start asking you for like gift cards and money and open up a account or personal information, do not give it to them. Do not even respond to them. Just block them and delete them and report them for, uh, for fraud. You know what I'm saying? And and, you know, people would do that, you guys. And Scab has been around for years on social media. It, it got really, really bad. And, and pretty much inflation has made it worse because now they're saying, oh, I don't got no food in my refrigerator. I don't got this. I don't got that. Everybody has food in their refrigerator, like 80 to 80% 80 of the people because they got food banks, they got food stamps, they got all kinds of stuff services. Most big cities that have sources out there to get food. You know what I'm saying? And a lot of people can do surveys like QB. Just, uh, on QB, what you do is you look up Q M E E on the Google Play Store. And then you download it. And then once you download it, you pretty much Fill out the questionnaire, the, the profile questionnaire, so it can match you to the right uh, surveys. 
And then they have a list of surveys you do. And once you complete the surveys, what you do is when you do the survey, you take your time, you try to be honest, and you try to answer the questions the best way you can. And then once you complete the survey, they pay you whatever the survey is worth. If the survey is worth like $3, they'll pay you $3. If the survey is worth like 80 cents, they'll pay you 80 cents. So far, so far. It all depends on what survey you do. They give you different surveys for different amounts. But even the small amounts that they pay you, it adds up. Because think about it for a second. If you do, if you complete like 10 surveys and you you start earning like small amounts, that adds up to like dollars. And then once you do it for a while, it pretty much pretty much would add up to like a hundred. But you gotta put the work in, you have to do it. And you have to not rush during the survey. And you plus you have to pretty much read the questions when you do the surveys and stuff. Try to understand what they're you know saying and try to know what how to answer it. Cause, cause if you know how to answer it and you find out how to pretty much answer it, then you would actually get paid instead of getting rejected from the survey. And once you get, once you do a lot of surveys, OQB, uh, what you do is, is pretty much how you get paid is basically separate. Once you complete the profile questionnaire and all that other stuff, you put the information in, you pretty much, you could either pick Venmo or you pick any, like a gift card payment, you get your gift card or you can pick a PayPal. But you got to make sure your PayPal is verified. And how you verify your PayPal is whenever you have a PayPal, you got to make sure you put your right information, your correct information. So you got to be able to identify you. And you got to make sure you pretty much make sure you have, you know, make sure you, uh, you know, confirm your email and your uh your pretty much your real phone number and all of all of your information is correct. And once you verify your pay file, you can pretty much receive payouts and, and you can cash out at any amount, like fifty cents, a dollar, five dollars, whatever. You know what I'm saying? It's simple as that. It's not hard at all. Anybody can do enough surveys to get pretty much some McDonald's food if they wanted to. Because I had made, one time I made like $19. And $19 is pretty much enough to get pretty much three sandwiches and some uh, fries and some, and some to drink. You know what I'm saying? That's enough to get like three or four packs of cigarettes. You know what I'm saying? Or it's enough to pretty much uh, get some you know, quarters for some luxury or something like that. So, y'all guys can do it. You, know, you just got to put your body to it and put the work in. Because if you don't put the work in it, it's not going to really matter or help you or nothing like that. Because everything you do in life, what if you work at McDonald's? What if you do surveys? What if you scan receipts? What if you, whatever you do, you gotta put the work in it. And once you put the work in it, and you put the time in it, you will pretty much, you know, be happy and satisfied, and it would pay off pretty well. So yeah. Alrighty, have a blessed, blessed day. Stay out of trouble, you guys. Because I know some of y'all be up to do that trolling stuff. And be up to that other stuff. But stay out of trouble. Stay positive. Stay blessed. And hit me up if you need to say hi or you need to question or something like that. So I will talk to y'all guys later. Bye-bye. See you later, alligators. I love all y'all. I really do. This is going to be a premiere on YouTube and it's going to go on uh, Facebook and it's going to go on TikTok. Okay? Bye bye. I love all y'all. Bye bye.